Alright guys, Kazoo71 here on Fjord Door. I want to show you guys where the Thylacolios are. Um, one of the players on my server had been taming these guys and I'm like, where are you getting these? And she's like, right around here. And I looked and looked and couldn't find them. So this this day on the game, whatever day I recorded this, I just spent like a whole while looking to try to find the location. So I want to show you guys where they're at because it was really annoying me. As you can see where I just flew into the Redwoods. I'll show you guys the exact coordinates in a second. But what I want to do is I want to show you guys where I found them at and then tame them. I'm just going to grab them. I'm going to flash forward to me dropping them on my island and taming them. And then I'll uh, kind of chop it up as much as I can so you don't have to watch the whole thing. But um, what I'm trying to do is this is one of the castles that's in the Redwoods. But what I'm trying to do is find out exactly where they are so I can show everyone who's, who's interested in looking for them. But for some strange reason, these guys are not... Um, spawning on the trees which is good for me because you can fly through the redwoods and they're not going to jump you off of the redwood trees like they normally do on the island or some of the other maps so these guys are on the ground so which is really cool it's good for me so as you can see I'm by that castle so I'm gonna show you guys around this area real quick and then we're gonna look for these guys and I could have cut this out but I wanted to show you guys where I'm at so you get a good idea of the, the lay of the land as I'm flying around on my wyvern and this is a lightning wyvern right out of the way if you can't tell. I've got the colors from one of the events when we had it on... Um, God, I can't remember where I got this one at. Might have bred it. Uh, actually, one of my daughters might have bred these and got these colors. Or I could have got it. I don't remember. Who knows where I got this thing from. But we breed them a lot um, on Genesis 2 and trying to get mutations and stuff. And that's what we do. So I'm pretty sure this is one of my daughters had bred this and got this pink color for me and got like a yellow yellow wings on another one and then I bred them together and got this pink and yellow one. Anyhow, no one really cares how I got my pink wyvern. Actually, some people probably do. Like, how you get a pink one? Well, you know, you also can get them on the events too. But then you got to breed them and cross them and stuff like that. Maybe I'll do a video on breeding one day. I still haven't done a video on that on um, mutating because there's so many videos people have out on mutations they're horrible but there's a lot of videos out on mutations I was trying to figure out how to do mutations I watched so many people's videos and still didn't have a clue so, I had to figure it out on my own basically so I'm just killing these sabers and stuff that's in the way don't want anything else around me as I'm looking I know there's got to be thylos around here somewhere, and that's why I'm in this area. Because this is about where she told me. So I'm going to show you guys the coordinates where I'm at so you get a good idea. So I am at latitude 23.7, longitude 87.4. And there I was on the map, if you saw the map there. And like I said, we're just wandering around here. I'm killing these sabers because I don't want these sabers. No one cares about sabers. I usually take them off the map on whatever game I'm playing on. But there's a Thylo right there. So there's my first one I found. There's a 140, which is pretty cool. And looks like there's another one right there, level 20. Who cares about the 20, 20? But I want that 140. So now you know where I'm at because I showed you guys the coordinates and these were right by it. So, um, which is really cool. And there's another one, a 150. So I want that 150. So we're going to land here. I'm going to grab my stamina back and I'm going to grab that 150. I'm going to come back for that 140. Um, not the one, not the 20. No one cares about that. Okay, so I grabbed this guy. So I got the 150. And what I do is I have enough stamina on my wyvern. I'm able to make it all the way back to my base. So what I'm going to do is flash forward here. Now what I'm using to tame these guys is uh, no trap. What I'm using is the harpoon launcher and net projectile. Both learned at level 43. And uh, net projectile was released on Genesis Part 2 in Lost Island. So I'm not sure if you if you don't have those maps, if you can use that or not. But uh, but that's what I'm using. So if you if you have those, the other, I'm also going to use a long neck rifle. You learn at level 35 with the shocking tranquilizer darts that you can learn at level 96. These are my best way to tame things. I love these guys. So um, you can use regular arrows and stuff. It's going to take a lot longer to knock them out and stuff. And now my server settings are turned up a little bit, so I knock things out a little quicker than normal. And what you see when I'm looking on the top left there is the awesome spyglass mod that I'm using on PC. And you can see this is going to take extraordinary kibble is the best way to do it. And it's going to take me three, but normally it would take eight for a level 150. 
and I'm going to go ahead and flash this across the screen right now for you so you can see what it would normally take. But in the background here, I knocked this guy out. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get on my wyvern and I'm going to go back and I'm going to get that other one. I'm not going to put any kibble in it now. I'm just going to let it starve for a second because um, I just because I just it's easier to do it that way. And then actually the reasoning I'm doing this is I'm going to go grab the other one and drop it on the island. And for some strange reason, this one would tame before I drop the other one. Then I'd have to deal with an aggressive thylo trying to kill the other one. So, so what I did was I used the teleport from superstructures. So I teleported um, closer to that area where I was. That's uh, another player on my server's uh, area right there. I teleported to his teleporter, which is he's right at the edge of the redwoods, in the redwoods. So he's pretty close to this castle. So I'm gonna get back in here and I'm gonna grab another one. Just gotta find these guys again. So look, I'm in the snow now, and look, there's a 145. That's not the same one I saw. Remember that other one was a 140. So we're gonna grab this 145. So the first one I grabbed was a 150R thylacolio, and this is a 145 normal thylacolio. So we're gonna flash forward here again. I'm back to the island. So all I'm doing is flying straight forward. I'm not speed flying or anything because it takes a little while. So I just want to flash forward. And you guys didn't need to watch me get here with that. But I'm going to go ahead and drop him. And get off. Grab my harpoon launcher out again. And try to get this one a little closer to my house. There we go. And it turns red because it sees me. And we're going to net it right there. Pull out my long neck rifle and drop this sucker. And as you can see, it's only going to take three kibble on this one as well. Like I said, my server settings are tweaked a little bit on my server. Normally, this would take anywhere from six to eight. 145, so I'm not exactly sure. Uh, probably seven. But there we go. It is knocked out. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here and I'm going to put some uh, extraordinary kibble in this one. Because I don't want to let it sit here and not eat. Should be good. Normally you'd have to narc these guys a lot, but since my settings are turned up a little bit, I don't have to narc them. So normally you'd probably use about 100 narcotics on one of these guys. So flash forward here again. I'm back over here again looking for that 140. And this time I want to show you guys a little bit more of this area because I kind of get a little turned around. And I could have cut this out to when I grabbed it, but I want to show you guys what else was around here. So I left this part in here. You can see as I'm looking at things, there's the uh, scorpions in here. And you guys saw sabers a while ago. You also saw that Alpha Rex I just passed. And then there's those little birds that are stuck on a tree. So I'm leaving the awesome spyglass on so I can show you guys and um, what's in this area. But I know that Thylo was around here somewhere, so I'm trying to find it really on the video. But there's a little bird in the tree. So let's see here. There's a 140 Bigfoot. Gigantopithecus, passive tames if you never tamed one. You can, by the way, you can grab that guy and drop it off somewhere safe. And then if it gets mad at you while you're carrying it, just it'll you know, fly away for a minute and then come back and then passive tame it in a safer area. Look, there's May wings in here. So I don't have any dinos added to my map. So these are all the dinos that are uh, wild card put on this map. And they put like almost every dino, not every, but quite a few of them from all the different. Uh, Genesis 2, Genesis 1. I mean, they added a bunch of stuff to this map. That's why this is a really cool map. This has got to be probably my favorite map now. It's always has been Ragnarok and the island, but now I kind of like this one a lot better. I still love the island. Island's the original, so that's why I like it so much. All right, where is this thing at? Come on, man. What's that? What the heck is that? I didn't catch a good look at it. Um, There's another Maywing. Or the same Maywing I passed already. <laughs> I'm going in circles. Not really. I'll be around here somewhere. There's a Thylo level 20. So that's where it was at. It's about at 21. So here we go. Should be in the right area. Unless that's another 20. There's an 85. Oh, another one spawned here. Okay, that's not the one I want. I want the 140. There he is. There's that 140. And they didn't attack me, they hit something else. I just landed right in front of them, so. Like they're attacking compies. Let's let them fight for a second. Let me get my stamina up and I'll grab that 140. And what I'm gonna do is I'll drop the 140 on the opposite end of the island, so in case one of them one's tamed already. 
And I gotta grab it first. Because uh, I missed pretty bad there. Don't laugh. I know you guys have missed also. There we go. Lining up. And we got them. Okay, here we go. Now I'm going to flash forward to my island, guys. And then, like I said, I'm going to put them on the opposite side of the island this time. So I'm going to put them on the right side in case those two on the left side are already tamed. And by the way, I'm building a wall around this island. It's just really slow progress. I don't cheat things in, so I build them. Grind and build. It takes a long time. So as I dropped him off right there. And we're going to go ahead and grab my harpoon launcher again. And try to get his attention and get him over here. Here we go. Come on. Hey, look at me. Tasty meat. Come get me. There we go. Now he's red. Okay, cool. Come on. Get a little closer. And he's distracted again. Come on. What the heck? Weird, huh? All right, there we go. But there's the third one down. So I'm going to go ahead and trank him. And get this one knocked out. As you can see, it don't take me too many tranks. And uh, if you guys pause that other thing from the wiki earlier, you can see about how many it would normally take. But there we go. Knock this one out. I'm going to go ahead and throw some kibble in this one because I'm done. I got three. I originally was going to grab the two, but then I saw that third one, that 145. So turn my spyglass off. We don't need that on anymore. Let's see what we got over here. pull this out I don't have to run all the way look like that one's tamed I'm gonna go ahead and whistle it over I could have walked over there but you know I'm lazy <laughs> but there's the art thylo so there you go that's the one that looked like a tiger I think these are cool looking with those different colors so there's one get a good picture of that I use that image for the uh, the video but there you go there's the art thylo and I'm being kind of crazy here. But there you go, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and this other one's going to tame here in just a second. But if you guys enjoyed it, finding out where these guys are located at, how to get them, a good way to tame them, um, please leave a like. Um, please subscribe if you haven't. And if you got any comments or any videos you'd like to see me try to do, or I'll, I'll do them if I can, just let me know. And like I said, thanks again for watching. And I will see you next time.